guys, welcome back to a new video. If you're new here, my name is Anushka. So today we're finally doing a foundation review. I asked you guys what product should I review on Instagram. A lot of you mentioned the new Makeup Forever Reboot Foundation, which I went online and bought straight away for this video. Um, I have been testing it out a couple of times, so this isn't a first impression, but I prefer to do it that sometimes because it just helps me you know, try it a bunch of times, you know, and really know how the product works. This video is actually sponsored by Shoptago, which is my favorite shopping app to use. It helps me um, organize my shopping, basically. If I'm considering to buy something, I can save it into one of my Shoptago wish lists. I can also organize my wish list in different sections, so like makeup, clothes, whatever you want, really. And now that Black Friday is around the corner, this is literally gonna be your best friend because you can save any items that you're considering to buy and save them into like a Black Friday wish list and then once it's Black Friday you can check if any of the items are on sale. So if you guys want to keep on top of your shopping game and be prepared for Black Friday I definitely recommend downloading the Shop Taker button to your browser which is super easy. You just have to go on their website, click the download button and it's just there. It literally takes just a minute, not even. You can then go to any of your favourite online shopping websites and save each item into your Shoptago wish list. You can also choose to get a push notification on your phone or by email whether your item is back in stock or if it goes um, on sale. When you add your items into your checkout, Shoptago will look for a bunch of coupon codes for you and apply them to see if you can get some money off. So it literally does the work for you. Instead of you going out and about on Google search looking for coupon codes for a particular website, it literally will search the internet for you and just do it all in one go. You literally just have to sit there and wait. That's my most favorite part about the app, but I also like being organized. And also for Black Friday, I'm just gonna put a bunch of stuff that I'm considering to get, but I don't wanna get just yet because like, it might go on sale on Black Friday. I will leave the link in the info box for you to download Shoptaker. It's completely free and super easy to use. Okay, now onto the foundation. I have the Makeup Forever one here. The shade I got is Y. 405. So on the bottle it says that it brightens, smooths, firms, hydrates and evens out the skin. On the website they have 24 shades so I think that's quite small for Makeup Forever. I do, I did struggle to find a shade. I was um, struggling between Y405 and Y445. But I know 445 will be really warm and I'm gonna get lighter anyways during winter so I went for 405. I feel like there could be a lot of shades in between the two. But to be honest, I'm not mad at the shade I got. It's not bad, but it can go a little bit ashy around my mouth. Um, so in that, and also I am more tanned at the moment. I just came from holiday. So I know like two weeks down the line, this will be a perfect shade for me. So I'm not too fussed about it, but it will look a little bit light right now. The foundation costs 32 pounds. I actually got it on this Guru Makeup Emporium website. I've bought a few times from them, but they have, um, a lot of new releases on their website so definitely recommend them you do get the standard 30 mil in here so we're just going to go straight on to applying it i really do like to use it with my sponge now this foundation for dry skin is going to be your best friend because it's so soft so luminous it has a very very nice glowy glowy finish and I feel like it adapts to your skin tone because even though this is a little bit light and I'm, in, I'm a bit more tan lately it works you know so it's so easy to blend it's really good in the morning as well when I go to work and I'm in a rush. I just literally just blend this as quick as possible and I'm out the door. Now, if you want a bit more coverage, you can definitely build up, which is what I do sometimes. Especially my nose, I have these scars. But I would definitely say it's more like a medium coverage. It's not full because I can still see parts of my skin through. And when I have these scars, they show through as well. So it's like medium. It's definitely backstage makeup during fashion week. They all have like this, all the models have super glowy, luminous skin. And this is it basically. Um, I've been having a really good experience with it. So this is the foundation applied. It actually smells really nice. It smells like skincare. Here's just a quick close up for you guys. I'm just going to finish the rest of my makeup and I'll be right back. Alright guys, this is what the foundation looks like. It's 
super stunning honestly because my skin has been so dry from being abroad and being from the plane and stuff this has been like the best purchase because it's super hydrating but not like oily hydrating i don't know how to explain it it's like it's like I've put a moisturiser and a normal foundation on, but it's in one product, you know? So I've been wearing this to work and the smile lines are so minimal. I think that's one thing I really do like about it. Um, there's some separation as always around my nose because that's where I touch it usually, but it's not a big deal because I wear it for such long hours. My face still looks put together by the end of the day, so just a bit of separation around my nose area is not a big deal to me, but everywhere else it looks so smooth really hydrating and even though sometimes i can get like an oily combination t-zone um it stays controlled in that area it doesn't go like oily greasy you know it feels super lightweight it just feels like healthy skin um i'm really happy with the shade the foundation is just is beautiful like what else can i say um a downside to it i feel like maybe the shades i feel like they can definitely add more tones and more shades um i feel like 25 or 24 is not enough I love how easy it is to blend. I like the way that it adapts to my skin tone. There's not much oxidization with it, personally. Um, it just stays like this. And my skin just looks healthy. It's like a healthy glow. Can you guys see that? I haven't even put highlight on. But it doesn't look oily or everywhere else. You know, it's just like, ew. Someone bring me on like a runway so I can start strutting with this foundation. So you can still see a little bit of pigmentation, but I'm not too bothered because I've been liking more natural skin-like makeup lately. But if you want like a full beat, you could probably get with this foundation, but not like Huda Beauty Faux Filter, not like this foundation. It's not full coverage like this. It's like a medium, medium to full almost, but very skin-like, I love it. Just makes it, and it definitely evens out. It doesn't accentuate texture pores it just looks healthy my favorite at the moment is definitely makeup forever luminous silk and the urban decay one but the urban decay Na stay naked foundation isn't as hydrating as these two i feel like the makeup forever one is definitely more hydrating than luminous silk but i love all these at the moment during winter my skin gets really flaky and really dry so I'm definitely going to be using this foundation a lot. If you do have oily skin, I definitely recommend a bit of powder with it, um, but it's not overly dewy. So I feel like anyone can wear this foundation. It's super nice. Guys, I can't rave about it enough. I'm just really glad you guys got me to buy this because I feel like it's going to become one of my go-tos, especially for winter. And I wasn't too sure on the shade, but it's perfect. I love it. Like, look, it, it matches. So if you have any questions about the foundation, let me know. If there are any other foundations you would like me to try, let me know in the comments below. And also, don't forget to subscribe if you haven't subscribed already. It takes two, two seconds. Hit the subscribe button. And lastly, don't forget to check out Shoptega. I'll leave a link in the info box. And guys, you just need it in your life. Okay, especially if you do a load of online shopping and you're gonna need it for black friday trust me i'm gonna stop talking thanks so much for watching guys and i will see you in my next one